In my previous video, I brought up the pain I feel when the Morjans come out of my brain, and since then, it happened. And as you see, it's a triangle mark on my forehead, and this happens when the Morjans leave your bloodstream, your chi energy fields. The demons are these little insects that cause diseases and illness and it's all ailments of the demons. I wanted to talk today about what it feels like when you get the demon in you, when the insect flies into you. And it feels like a few different things. Sometimes it feels similar to them coming out, so sometimes it's hard to tell when they're going in or out, but you could feel a disturbance in the chi energy field around you and usually you feel it with your your psychic senses or even with your hands you could feel that the skin is different there that there's a hole under the skin that the energy is hot or if it's cold there and if it's unbalanced from the rest of the parts of the body um, they're basically like fleas where they hop off different people and different things through the tv the phones music and from anyone outside and in stores and even the fluorescent lights in a lot of the stores you go to like Dollar General or even in institutions and things there's always like a myriad of fluorescent lights and that's just to feed and produce these insect demon parasites into the air and when they fly into you it's like a sting or you even feel like a vibration or a pain. Uh, a lot of the time I walk back past possessed people in the streets and uh, my neck will feel pain or my back will ache. I'll feel something go in me. Um, I'll have a bad thought. I'll feel depressed. I'll feel angry. And all those are side effects of the demon going into you. Also, uh, a way to protect yourself from these demons is to keep yourself covered not dressing provocatively and covering your head with a hat and also keeping your gaze low because sometimes you look at someone or if they look you in the eyes they transfer their demons into you through their thought through their thoughts and through the demons thinking through them and flying through them into you so i recommend wearing a hat everywhere you go even in your own home and covering your feet, not showing your legs, arms, chest, stomach. Um, I notice that I can't dress provocatively in public. I'll get a lot of pains and I'll get sick really bad and I'll have anger, rage, headaches, hair falling out, pains in my body. And this is all from the Archons being attracted to you, the demons, the Morgellons, these insects being attracted to you and drawn to you when you're dressed this way and that's why the government and propaganda want you dressing in a certain way so that it feeds the Archons, these Morgellons. And also an important way of getting them out is taking baths in different anti-Morgellon chemicals such as borax, silica, turmeric, vinegar, Epsom salt, I put kratom in my bath, other things, smoking blend I make. Um, I have a smoking blend also that protects me and gets them out of me. Um, I start off with some pipe tobacco, some CBD, blue lotus, wild daga, damiana, kana, mugwort, mullein, clove powders, teas and basically I just smoke that and I put silica in that as well so I'm constantly smoking silicone dioxide which is constantly 
removing them. I notice if I take high doses of silica for a long period of time, that's when they come out of my head. Uh, last time I had three in a line like this when they came out and three line going down. And right now it's a triangle as you can see on my head. Um, extremely painful, but it's extremely worth it. And also when these demons come out, um, you could hear like ticks on the walls and you could hear um, them come out of your body and your own body and you'll even be able to communicate with them. Say like, I, I noticed you demon moving in my knee and then it'll move through your knee to your foot and you'll feel it in your foot and if you command them out enough they'll just leave also so basically that i'm able to see them feel them hear them sense them and communicate with these unseen entities and they're very tricky mischievous for the most part but there's good ones there's bad ones there's all different types religious ones non-religious ones, devil, devilish ones, but for the most part, they're all very tricky and malevolent, the ones that afflict us. So when I go out and I go in stores, I feel like I'm in a fog of, of like dirty energy, low frequency vibrations, and I, I'm sensing the demons flying into me and sometimes I feel them go in my eye from other people, especially if they're playing like loud music or talking loudly about like nonsense, I'll feel the demon go right in my eye if I'm getting mad or upset. It starts with that thing going on. And also when we used to have to wear the masks all the time, um, I would get I actually could feel it right now thinking about it. I think I still have it because other people carry this parasite that goes up your nose and into your brain. And it, it goes through the mask and in the Bible it talks about that the mark of the beast will put a parasite in your nose that goes to your brain and it controls you, your way of thinking. And I've gotten that parasite so many times from people walking by who are brainwashed about how the masks actually do something and basically I just want people to be more aware of this and the more you know the less you know but the more you know is more of a power you have over these things that want to have power over you and at the end of the day the demons want to control you and not for you to control them so knowledge is power in this regards and take hold of your being and God is the merciful and the wise and the all-knowing and we are in this for the next life. I'm making an anti etheric energy parasite bath. Observe. Borax. Turmeric. Turmeric. Magnesium sulfate, amethyst, selenite, Vitamin C tablets? Yes, so. I'll do one better. Mm. Some lemon juice. 
Did they not back? Move it in. Take a look at the color. The turmeric turns red in an alkaline base. Vinegar. Is it? Smoking blend? No, it's toxic. Looks like snakes coming out of the water. 